Hi, I'm Sam, a spray product engineer at Spraying Systems Company. Today we're going to talk about nozzle bearding. Nozzle bearding is the buildup of material on the outside of a spray nozzle, as you see here. Bearding is most commonly caused by the sprayed liquid drifting back onto the nozzle and drawing on the outside or the orifice of the nozzle. Applications using air atomizing nozzles that produce small drops that evaporate quickly are particularly prone to bearding. Bearding is problematic because the dried material can partially block the orifice and alter the spray pattern, or even completely clog the nozzle. Even if the dried material is just on the exterior of the nozzle and not the orifice, it still creates a maintenance nightmare. Dried material can be difficult to remove. Nozzle maintenance time and labor costs increase and production time decreases. In addition, the dry material can break off the nozzle and contaminate a production run or even damage downstream equipment. The best way to combat bearding? Use nozzles that are designed with this problem in mind. These nozzles change the point of atomization and spray formation and prevent droplets from being deposited back onto the nozzle. We offer anti-bearding versions of many of our spray nozzles used in food processing, spray drying, tablet coating, and gas conditioning. If bearding is a concern in your application, be sure to talk to your local spray specialist. He or she can help you choose an appropriate anti-bearding nozzle that helps to minimize maintenance downtime and ensure product quality. Just call 895-SPRAY or visit spray.com to learn more.